Hello, AE Car here with another banger video but today is not a normal day, today is the day I start narrating all future videos, but enough with that, let's get to it. Here is an easy tutorial to become a master of using BMNG Drive's Replay and Script AI Manager features, there are many uses for both these features that I will list here. Anyways, enough with the dilly dally let's get to it. To get the replay feature, you want to open the menu by clicking escape and then click UI apps at the top. Then click, add apps, this is where the replay app is located by scrolling down you can find it. You can also go to the search bar on the top right and search the word replay. Next you can double click the icon and you will be taken to the edit apps screen. Here you can move all the on screen UI features as well as your new replay app. Click escape twice to exit this screen and now you have the replay feature. You can begin by clicking the little red dot here and start driving around. As I drive, the replay feature will essentially memorize every movement my car makes till I end the replay. To end the replay, just click the red dot turn square and it will play back for you. Yippee! You can quote unquote delete, the replay by clicking the white square but don't worry, all replays are saved locally, so even if you do accidentally click it, it will still be there. The biggest difference between the script AI manager and the replay feature is the fact that the replay feature just copies everything you do, whereas the script AI manager makes a path for an AI to follow, so the AI is kinda dumb and can't really do burnouts like the ones I just did. Let's check out the script AI manager using the new minivan. The script AI manager is mostly used in those beam crash compilations you see every once in a while on YouTube shorts. In order to get to the script AI manager you need to click F11 and it will take you to the world editor. From there click the window button at the top left. Once you click it type into the search bar, script, and it should pop up. Once you click it this little window should pop up, this is the script AI manager. You can put it anywhere you feel comfortable with it on your screen. Next to begin recording your script AI path, you want to click this little white button next to whatever car you currently want to drive. Now click F11 once again and start driving around. Watch as I pull the emergency brake, when I turn on the actual script AI, it will not pull it, it will just slow down, this is why you can't do things like drifting with the script AI. Click F11 and click the stop recording button, then click the play recording button and watch an AI drive your route. Watch the area where I pulled the emergency brake earlier. The AI does not do that because script AI is just you driving a path for an AI to drive. You can also make a police chase using the same method by making an AI route and chasing after them with your own car. Time to press play in the AI script manager and chase the most wanted fugitive Malrick Shaw. You can also press the record button on the replay app at this time if you would like to replay the chase. Yes finally, there we go, I got him, your days of conquering the universe are over, Mr. Malrick Shaw. Anyways thank you for watching such a monumental video in my YouTube career and please like and subscribe, I am begging for you to comment down below a crash or scenario I should make. Thank you, and goodbye.